All right, do you want to reverse osteoarthritis? I mean, do you want to get rid of those persistent pain you always have in your joint? In this video, I'm going to show you the steps, the action to beat osteoarthritis, the best remedy to reverse osteoarthritis, okay? So this video is really going to help you if you want to be free from those joint pain and then joint stiffness. Make sure to stay tuned. Now, osteoarthritis is a form of chronic degenerative joint diseases that primarily stem from the destruction of cartilage which helps in cushioning the joint. Now this is the reason why you see most people with osteoarthritis do have joint pain and then joint stiffness and things like that. Now the global incidence of this problem osteoarthritis is increasing and then it is believed to be the fourth leading cause of disability worldwide affecting more than 230 million people. Now this is mostly due to factors like aging, I mean if you are above 60 years of age as well as obesity. Now being overweight or being obese actually puts more pressure and stress on your joint, most especially the weight-bearing joints like the ones in your hip and the ones in your knees, okay? So obesity also has metabolic effects that can increase the risk factor of um, osteoarthritis. Now how does this problem of cartilage destruction that result in this problem of osteoarthritis come about in the first place? So there is this protein, or you can call it enzyme, MFP, which stands for matrix metalloproteinase. And these proteins are highly expressed in individuals with osteoarthritis. And the subtype of this protein, MFP1, MFP3, and MFP13, have been found to be implicated in the destruction of cartilage. And these proteins are produced in the joint in response to inflammation. So this is where inflammation comes into play in the development of osteoarthritis. Now along with this protein, there is also another protein called agrikinesis. And just like the first protein we talked about, agrikinesis is also involved in the destruction of cartilage, in the breakdown of those proteins that make up the cartilage, okay? So the collective action of these two proteins result in osteoarthritis. So what can you really do to stop the destruction of cartilage? What can you do to stop the degradation of those proteins that may up the cartilage. Well, first things first, for those people who are obese, you first have to start by losing weight. You have to start by doing exercise as well as intermittent fasting to strip up those extra fat because being overweight actually puts additional pressure on your joints, causing the destruction of cartilage. And also, obesity also results in inflammation. And we all know that inflammation activates those proteins that causes the destruction of cartilage that results in osteoarthritis, okay? So you have to start by losing weight. The best remedy you should be taking if you have osteoarthritis is glucosamine. Now, glucosamine is a very important compound that occurs naturally in our body. And then as people age, they apparently lose the ability to manufacture adequate amounts of glucosamine. Now, this glucosamine does not just delay the degradation of those proteins in your cartilage, it does not just delay the destruction of cartilage, but also it helps repair and regenerate damaged cartilage by serving as a building block for those proteins that are involved in the production of cartilage, okay? So glucosamine is very important in protecting your cartilage in reversing osteoarthritis because it's one of the key components of your cartilage. Now, where can you get this glucosamine? What are the best sources? Well, the thing is that there are no food sources of glucosamine, but the good news is that it is available as a dietary supplement. You can get it in supplement form, which are derived from the shell of crabs, lobster, or shrimp. Now, you don't actually need to be taking too much. You just have to be taking about 1,500 milligrams of glucosamine every single day. That is going to help reverse osteoarthritis that is going to help repair damaged cartilage, okay? And along with glucosamine, you also have to be taking the vitamin D. Vitamin D is very anti-inflammatory, as well as Cree oil, which is a great source of omega-3 fatty acids, most especially the potent form of omega-3, which reduces inflammation, as well as suppressing and inhibiting the protein that are involved in the destruction of cartilage. In one interesting study, they found that people who had osteoarthritis after taking just 300 milligrams of Cree oil every single day for 30 days, they found that these people had their inflammation, their muscle stiffness, their joint pain reduced by 30%. So 
So crude oil is very effective in protecting against osteoarthritis as well as in reversing osteoarthritis. So make sure to start eating it. Just 300 milligrams every single day is going to do a lot of wonders in your body. Okay? So if you follow this tip, if you start by taking glucosamine, vitamin D, as well as crude oil, this is going to go a long way in helping you reverse osteoarthritis. Okay? If you find this video helpful, I'll be very glad if you like this video and then you subscribe to this channel. Thanks for watching.